The Dilemma for the Square. My motto, plain honesty, simple truth, easy understanding. The joy of finding things out for yourself. What's the dilemma? Well, am I a square or a cube? The simpletons, inequality, equality. One, for the square, a plus b all squared equals a squared plus 2ab plus b squared. 26 plus 1 all squared equals 26 squared plus 2 times 26 times 1 plus 1 squared is equal to 26 squared plus 7 squared plus 2 squared equals 27 squared equals 729 equals 3 to the power 6. 2. For the cube, a plus b all cubed equals a cubed plus 3abc plus b cubed. 8 plus 1 all cubed equals 8 cubed plus 3 times 8 times 1 times 9 plus 1 cubed equals 8 cubed plus 6 cubed plus 1 cubed equals 9 cubed equals 729 equals 3 to the power 6. So, 26 squared plus 7 squared plus 2 squared equals 8 cubed plus 6 cubed plus 1 cubed. Well, is it a square or is it a cube? So for the benefit of the math magicians, to help keep them engaged for the next 400 years, seeking a mathematically unimportant abstract proof that only a handful of them will purport to understand, I will make the following conjecture. Conjecture. Are 26 squared plus 7 squared plus 2 squared equal to 8 cubed plus 6 cubed plus 1 cubed the only square and cubic quadruples that are equal to one another? Or are there 1. Finitely many or 2. Infinitely many? The Simpletons Mathematical Coat of Arms In Euclid we trust not mathematicians. That's all folks, till next time.